I see him! Come on! We're close! Now that was a close one. This might be a good time to mention our sponsor, Proton Paul's Lunar Funeral Home. Don't settle for a boring afterlife. Spend eternity spinning in your grave, thanks to Proton Paul's Zero G Coffins. <laughs> This is an interesting development. It appears that strange, unidentified robots have teleported into city limits. I'm no expert, but they don't appear to belong to Dr. Nefarious. One could only surmise that these robots have chosen to take advantage of our distraction with this group and invade our city. Well played, Ratchet. I've done it. Now is my fist taste. <laughs> Looks like greetings, citizens, and thank you for taking part in friendship through firepower. Are you ready to get certified? Since this is just a recording, I'll assume you said yes. This automated training program will teach you how to use your new combustor. Start by unholstering your weapon. Okay, safety precautions, disclaimers, warnings. Aha! Okay, step one. Fire! Impressive shooting, citizens. You mastered the same technique I employed when I vanquished Dr. Nefarious. Sorry. Guess I'm having a hard time listening to myself. One thing that surprised me when I first became a hero was how much people don't enjoy getting shot. If your target refuses to stand still, try locking onto them with your weapon. If you're not me, chances are you'll need assistance from time to time. Try firing your combustors at once to deliver a supercharged blast of power. Congratulations, citizens. You are now certified to carry a weapon inside city limits. Thank you for your participation in the French Group Firepower Initiative. Have a truly awesome day. Just what the technician ordered. <laughs> the Zagroot has just been sighted making its way towards the Luminopolis power plant, and it looks like the unidentified robots are following. They must be here for the Zagroot. Uh, Kip, you can come out from under your desk. I follow the truth wherever it leads, Pepper. Looks like our heroes have acquired some new firepower. These things will be able to ambush the Zagroot. If three marriages taught me anything, it's that deception and surprise are the key ingredients to any successful offensive.
free ammo. Where was I? Ammunition acquired. Nice! More ammo! to check in with Born Garblack about the mysterious robots tracking the Zagroot. Minister Garblack, any ideas as to who owns these robots? Oh, 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 well done, Ratchet. How convenient. I detect trouble ahead. I found ammo! with bated breath as perhaps the strangest team in Polaris history wants to defeat the deadly light-eating Zagroot. Just a reminder, tonight's battle to the death is brought to you by Big Al's Robo Jack and Gaming Superstore, owning noobs for over a decade. Oh, Jesus, I believe I require ammunition. but I believe destroying those generators would prevent the Zagrood from healing himself. There's no room for speculation in this game, Pepper. And down he goes! The Zagrood has been defeated! I tell you, ladies and gentlemen, this Zagrood man hasn't seen anything like this in all his years in the industry. And there has been a 
amount of damage. Our station patrols are still taking count, but it appears that we're looking at billions of bolts worth of property damage. A city in shambles, a galaxy in debt, and a lavish Meridian City retreat forged from expensive raritanium. All this begs the question, has the galaxy had enough of Copernicus Quark? Wait! This fight may not be over! The Zaglut is back! And boy does he look angry! I can barely watch, folks. The monster is breaking through everything in its path with bloodthirsty resolve. It's like watching some elderly cat lady on Black Friday as she crawls her way mercilessly toward the last pair of self-cleaning stunderwear. Our heroes may be in real trouble. The Zagroot does not seem to be giving up. Look! The Defense Force installed fusion turrets on top of Zog Tower! It looks like the heroes are attempting to use the fusion turrets on top of Zog Tower. Citizens will remember former Minister of Defense Artemis Zog had them installed in the event of an attack by Dr. Nefarious. How's that for irony? If your enemy refuses to come out from behind cover, try your hand at the Plasma Bomb Launcher. This doohickey lobs grenades armed with unstable plasma. For an added kick, try firing multiple plasma bombs at the same target. 